Happy morning, everybody. Welcome to Superb Story, a time where you become thought leaders by listening to wonderful life skills, life stories, and drawing life skills, life values. Uh, today, we have something slightly different than just the story. This is a real incident that took place. So this uh, picture you see on your screen, she, Sailesh, uh, Yashmin, you see this image? See this image. There's something very special about this image. Yeah. Alabani is the band of the bread. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So, Yukta, uh, can you stop the share, please? Now we'll get back to the story. This uh, actually forms the context of the story. Ah. Now, listen to this. What exactly happened? She ready? Silence, everybody. Sashikala ji, ready? Yeah. So this is what exactly happened. Okay. Uh, this girl is just five years old. Her uncle, who was coming back from school, saw her and took this picture. And this video of this girl carrying this loaf of Alabani bread. She was a mom and was given a task. She was saying, and she was running home. And he captured the genuine and the innocent happiness on her face. This picture, Dikta became viral. People said it is kind, kind of a picture that they would associate with bread. Soon the picture was all over the billboards of the truck of Alabani, on the trucks of Alabani. The bread company, you know, they put it on this thing. Alabani recognized the girl's name is Letu Kunya Mayaji. The beautiful five year old girl that warmed the South Africans with a radiant, and it's from South Africa, radiant smile. Okay. People requested that Alabani should put up a billboard with this beautiful picture. Alabani responded because they spoke to the family. They spoke to the family that can we do this? And the little girl got, or see, what the little girl got back? She got a full, full education Till she graduates. And the single mother, they were very struggling. Single mother had gotten a new house from the bread company. Yeah. The little girl remains, uh, remains the Albany bread uh, uh, ambassador till date. She's the brand ambassador. Once again, Jukta, can you show the uh, image again? Yeah. Yes. So this is the image of the girl. Her uncle took and it went viral. And uh, South Africa, the Alabama, the brave, this thing, the bread company, uh, gave her, it became so popular, it became like a brand image. And she became a brand ambassador. So, Yukta, now can you, uh, I'll, I'll reclaim as the host. Thank you, Yukta, for the share. Wonderful, this girl became the brand ambassador. And uh, everybody in Vajrasan. Yukta, you're sitting in Vajrasan. Very nice. Beautiful. beautiful. Yeah, staying sharp. Yes. Oh, wonderful. She and Sailish both moved into Vajrasa. So amazing. Yashmir already sitting in Vajrasa. Very nice. So what did we learn from this wonderful, beautiful story? Push yourself. She, she very nice. Push yourself, uh, Sailish. How long you can sit. And uh, she, this is one thing which is wonderful. Habit. Just to have a uh, very good stomach, digestion, and also for weight loss. Yesterday, you know, Yukta said 5 kg she lost. It was very painful. Correct, Yukta, at the beginning? We'll talk about that in just a while. Meanwhile, what did we see? Uh, what did we learn from this true incident? Amazing picture, right? We zoom in and see she's got wonderful, beautiful smile. I will send this to all of you. Ah, what did we learn?
the future can be shown in the childhood too sorry the future can be seen in the childhood too future can be seen in the childhood wonderful very nice laugh at the uh, laugh in the face of pain laugh in the face of pain beautiful very nice coach yes yukta coach i'm not sure when this picture was taken but south africa is known as one of the poorest countries so even though it was going through an econo economic like downfall or something the girl was still happy that she got that packet of bread from the from the shopkeeper so even when you're going through a lot of pain even when you're going through challenges even if you're facing challenges facing them with a smile is what makes you the great person very nice beautiful in spite of what circumstances we are going through still keeping a smile always be grateful for what you have ah very nice She wonderful. Be grateful for whatever we have. Good happiness is the key. So nice, Salish. Wonderful and. Like you are the youngest, the most happiest person of here. Being happy is the key. Happiness is the key. So nice. Anybody else would want to add or share? Add anything? Have a smile, spread a smile. Have a smile, spread a smile. Wonderful. Ayuta, we were talking about the three steps: the have a goal, have a focus, what you want to be, do it with happiness, do it with a smile, and do it with a discipline. Let's connect this to that. The three-step process. Either today, she, every, either today, people are living in the future, worried about what's going to happen tomorrow. I have a test tomorrow. I have this. If they're constantly worried about, they're anxious, anxious about it. There is a lot of anxiety about it, or there is a uh, all the regrets about the past, forgetting to live in that one particular moment. Whatever you're doing, do it with a smile. You thought today's morning ritual. Did you do it with a smile? Now that exactly is the difference. When you start enjoying whatever you are doing, you have to do it. Do it with a smile. You start doing your math with a smile. You start playing tennis with a smile. Well, as Shailesh said, happiness is the key. That's the reason why your progress is only temporary. Just going through it, not enjoying the process. Yeah, have goals. Have all of that. That this day I'll become that. That day I'll become. But if you start doing that, being in the moment and enjoying that moment, Uta, when you're solving that uh, math sum, she, when you're studying and you're enjoying it, and your mind is there and you are enjoying and doing it, see the creation that you will do. That's what this. This is my opinion about the simple thing. If the getting fun, yesterday also we were talking about getting fun in what you are doing right now will take you there. Not that fun, fun that we are talking about in the school. 
that fun is not going to get you there. That's just nothing but uh, just cheap thrills and uh, cheap thrills and only distraction. Nothing else. Isn't it? This is what will help you. Sitting in the morning ritual in Vajrasana, becoming a thought leader, using your mind to expand. Isn't it? When you will be facing those interviews, no one's going to ask you what did you do in school and what fun, what kind of a uh, small talk that you had. All that is not fun. All that is just cheap thrill. Over a period of time, as you will grow, you'll come to know, yes, me enjoying that math, so me enjoying that mind map, me studying for the physics, me studying that for me doing my morning ritual with complete happiness, me sitting in Vajrasit in that difficult time, that is where exactly. And that is what one person people do. That point one or one person or even less than point one person people, they enjoy the process. They, they embrace the process. They are not Yukta, they are not having for them. Achieving the goal is not about enjoying it. They enjoy the process. Let me enjoy the process. Anyway, I'm doing it. I was also telling you, Yukta, that I like uh, I like junk food. But Yukta, you've seen me eating salads and healthy food and all that, correct? Have you seen I do it with a smile or do it with a regret? Yukta? I can't hear you. You're on mute. Smile, coach. Yeah, that's what I've decided anyway. That, that is something. But I don't like it. I don't like eating so many, so much of salads. But I started making a part of my life that whatever it is, I am going to enjoy it. And that is the outcome of the health that I have. Got. That's where exactly uh, when you understand that part, you will not go for cheap thrill. For me, eating a chip or having french fries or eating any of those is no cheap thrill. I hope you guys understood and understood the value that I wanted to share all the other things. But once again, Sailesh, very good. Happiness is the key. She, be grateful of whatever you have and focus at that moment. Focus at that moment that I'm going to enjoy whatever I'm doing and see the results. The results will be mind-blowing. The girl is just smiling. And she got paid for her entire education. Awesome, right? Anyway, that's a little different take from there. That today we are not smiling much. We are more worried. Go through the day with so much of pressure. And why can't we do the whole thing with so much of enjoyment? Enjoy your day. Enjoy whatever you're doing. Anyway, we know we are doing the right thing. Correct? Uh, she, can I ask you a question? She, do you like getting up in the morning, sitting here? Be very honest. Uh, sometimes yes, sometimes no. It's like a 50 50. Correct. But if you can, but you know, what is the right thing? You smile and do it. No, what is the right thing? Sleeping or waking up now and doing the morning ritual? Wake up, waking up now and doing the morning rituals. 100% about that? Yeah. Are you clear about the right thing, Yukta? Getting up in the morning. And dedicating yourself for all this morning ritual and these good habits. This is it 100%. Are you sure that this is the right thing to do? Yes, coach. So, do, but my question to you is do you enjoy it every single day? No, coach. Then you see the results are exactly. So, you can do the right thing, but you enjoy doing the right thing. Boom. That is the time you will see something amazing will come. Do the right thing and enjoy doing the right thing. Yeah, don't look for cheap thrills, cheap pleasure and all the things. This is not everybody. Correct, no? Yashmit, coming to morning ritual, doing your exercises, doing your pranayams and all the things, the right thing? 100% are you convinced that this is the right thing to do in the morning? Yeah. But do you like coming? Sometimes no, sometimes yes. Correct? 
why don't you make it every single time become that person become that person who enjoys the process and you will achieve it much more better several studies it's taking a little longer several studies she yukta yukta especially for you yukta to understand studies again and again say happy people achieve things faster happiness is a priest uh, this thing precedes everything enjoy i have chosen the right thing to do i know what is the right thing to do i am going to do it with a smile and i am going to enjoy it thoroughly i like it or not like it is a secondary thing let me put it aside yeah i'm going to do it with a smile that is what if the what is the one word for it a for attitude Now that attitude. is the, that is the attitude of a champion and i champion as the attitude yeah i am liking it or not liking it secondary i don't like silence but the attitude i have is i'm going to enjoy eating silence it's 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 beautiful it's fun yes so the moment i do that the same silence becomes so much healthier for me i do the prayer i do i enjoy it that's how it becomes you tell you learn and you did vajrasan but most of the time you are sore otherwise you would have learned it faster you would have overcome the pain much more easy oh what is this why this is this and that's that is the way people stay ordinary so she sailors everybody yashwat everybody you will come on to become extraordinary whatever it is you have decided that this is the right thing and you know that this is the right thing start doing with a smile enjoy the process if you enjoy the process happy happiness is the key to do it have be grateful for it and see how awesome it love you yukta back to you do the morning ritual with a smile enjoy the process and you see how beautiful you'll feel about it and you will see wow life is so beautiful because we forget to enjoy the small small moments yes everybody in vajrasan push yourself how much ever everybody push yourself because you know is the right thing to do close your eyes gyan mudra and this time not this time every single time have a smile on your face it go over to you you take over let's start the short meditation Now let's start with our alternate nasal breathing.
Now let's start with Let's start with our bee breathing. Six counts. Hum. 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 Start with Anjaisa. Now let's start with our gratitude. Brush your hands. Thank yourself for being such an amazing person. Always so kind, always so caring. Always focused on your goals. Thank yourself for always being so considerate. Always taking care of people. Always caring about people. Thank yourself for always doing everything with a smile. Thank yourself for always smiling in every situation, whether good or bad. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank yourself for always facing the problem with a smile. Thank yourself for always solving every single challenge. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you to Pillars of Support, your mom and your dad for always being there for you. They've given you everything you need, whether it's food to eat, a shelter to live in, or clothes to wear. They've given you love and care all throughout your life, and they'll keep giving it, they'll keep giving it to you. Thank your parents for teaching you very good values. Values about life, kindness, care, loyalty, empathy, honesty. Thank your gurus, your teachers, your coaches for always being tough on you, for always pushing you forward, so that pushing you to the limit so that you, you can be better in your life later. Thank them. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, friends and your family for always supporting you, being there whenever you needed them. They've also given you love and care throughout your life. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Mother Nature for giving uh, oxygen to breathe, water to hydrate ourselves and food to eat. Without these resources, we will never be able to live. Thank the Mother Nature for, thank the trees for producing oxygen and fruits. Thank the rivers, the streams for providing us water. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now thank the God, the Almighty Soul for always giving you everything in abundance, whether it's life, health, wealth, education, kindness, Honesty, smile, a laughter. Thank you, God. Thank you, Almighty. Thank you, Supreme Soul, for giving us this wonderful soul, soul with a purpose, soul with a vibe. Let's have a beautiful visualization. Our beam of light is coming 
and rejuvenating us, revitalizing us, re-energizing us. We, by this uh, white light, enters every part of the body, removes all the negativity, all the toxins, and brings a wonderful smile on our face. Now that we are in an amazing state, a great state of mind, visualize your goals, visualize your purpose. Visualizing your goals and your purpose on a daily basis keeps you on track, keeps you focused, enjoy the process. Now that we have completed our visualization, our goal setting, slowly let go of your hands, hands on your heart. I am a champion. I am, I a, am champion. a champion. I smile every time. I smile, I every, smile time. every time. I do everything with a smile. I do, I do everything with a smile. Happiness is the key. Happiness, Happiness is, the key. is the key. I do the right thing with, with a smile. I do, the, I right do the right thing with a smile. I do the right thing with happiness. I do the right, I do the thing, right thing with happiness. happiness. I'm born to win. I'm born. I'm born to win. I'm born to lead. I'm born to lead. I'm, to lead. I'm lovable. I'm lovable. I'm lovable. Capable. I'm capable. I'm capable. I am a superb human. I am. I am a superb human. Pin drop, clap, punch. We're all in play. One, two, three, four, four. <laughs> yes. Slowly open your eyes and welcome a wonderful day and live powerfully, live purposefully. Have a great day. Everybody, live powerfully, live purposefully, live with a smile. Bye-bye. Hello, everybody. My name is Dr. Sachin and I am a life coach. I use games, activities and exercises to teach young champions valuable life skills and study skills, which help them become number one in studies and number one in life. Continue to watch our videos, share them, subscribe to our channel and please do comment. It'll help us, it'll inspire us to make more good content like this. Thank you so much for watching our channel. Also do visit our website. Thank you so much.